Kazimir Malievich's abstract art has my attention for some time now. It looks so simple. Maybe I can discover new things by repainting the Malievich Black Square 1915. Just after this. Hey, Albert here at The Perfect Paintings, where it's all about improving your painting skills by looking at art, yourself and the world around you. In case you're new to this channel, why not subscribe and click on the bell so you'll be notified for the next video. A little black square art history. Abstract art started to emerge around 1912. In 1915 an exhibition opens in Petrograd, now St. Petersburg. Kazimir Malievich is one of the artists. The room with its geometric abstract art shows this mysterious black square hung across the corner of the room, the traditional place of an icon. He calls his new art style suprematism, the victory of pure form over realism. At his funeral in 1935, his coffin showed Malievich, black square and circle. Unfortunately, the political climate has changed and museums were ordered to take and Malievich art of the walls. For years, Kazimir Malievich paintings vanished for, for the public. Why is Malievich Black Square important? People were used to representations of landscapes, people, or things, and boom, there was Mr. K. Malievich who gave you this look to look at a black square. He didn't even try to make it more interesting by suggesting three dimensions. I take my paper and paint and start repainting his artwork. The original dimensions are 79 by 79 centimeters and I only have 65 by 65 centimeter paper, at least it's also a square. When the black square was painted by Kazimir Malievich, black and white were the only two colors he used. Malievich, suprematism, as he called his new art movement, it also a transcendent, a spiritual aspect. That's why he hung his painting at the exhibition on the place of an icon. When trying to understand it, I translate this spiritual aspect to the light and the dark. Is it about birth when you see the light and death when the light in your eyes dies? Or maybe it's more about the everlasting battle in everyone between the inner light and the dark deeds and thoughts? On a more artistic level, as a painter, you play the game of balance between light and the dark. Too much dark and the light disappears, and too much white and the dark isn't a threat anymore. You try to find the balance where it can go either way. That's what makes a painting interesting to look at. This little black square in the big white is more a nuisance, it's not that important. When you make a rectangle of it, it doesn't resonate anymore with the square form of the paper. It's an object on its own and it's not that interesting. At this moment the square becomes more important, but the white is still the boss. Western society we read from left to right. On a timetable the right side is later in the day or week. So when the black square is located more on the right side of the paper we tend to think of it as on the move. The problem is going away, it's only a matter of time and it's gone. The thread disappears out of the painting.
again a new situation. Disrespectfully, it looks like a light switch to me. That's me blocking the view. It is more or less finished at this moment. Not perfect, but good enough. But I want to try something, so I continue painting. This is interesting to me. When looking in the upper left corner you get the idea of the original Majewicz black square. The volume of white is still strong enough, although the black is quite dominant. On the lower right corner you see what happens when the white is smaller. To me this looks like a white frame around the black painting. The relevance of the white paint in the painting is gone, it's only there to emphasize the black. Back to the white paint to correct the balance in this painting. I had to paint this white three times over, the black was very persistent, but this is the end result. The world only talks about the first man on the moon, nobody cares about the second one. People want to know who won the game, the race, or who is number one on the billboard charts. The art world is no different, Russian artist Maljevic was the first, so everybody talks about Maljevic black square 
and Kazimir Mojevic primitive composition. This is the way we honor our explorers, inventors and artists. When you look around on the internet you find lovers and also a lot of haters of Kazimir Mojevic Black Square. They say that their six year old could do it, but it didn't. They say it's not art because it's not a nice picture. Or they deconstruct the black square as just a canvas with black paint on it. I see what they're getting at, but in my opinion they are all missing the point by a mile. The black square wasn't a coincidence. When you look at Kazimir Mojevic art on the internet, I see that this black square abstract painting is the result of a creative process. How Kazimir Mojevic found his own voice. Isn't that the reality in all arts? I find it an intriguing painting. By repainting it, I experienced how important balance can be. I learned to appreciate it more and I love it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend. Subscribe and click on the bell to be notified of the next video. And click or tap on the screen to see another one. And until next time, keep painting!